I have made allowances. Different institutions, different styles, a different type of prisoner. Governor, I'm not trying but to excuse But I see no happened. reason to alter my first impression. That standards here are, well, not what I'm used to. In what way, madam? There is a lack of precision. A sense almost of complicity with the prisoners. Complicity? That is a reflection on our fitness to be in the service at all. I didn't intend that, Mrs. Armitage. I know you are an excellent disciplinarian. Governor, we... We have always tried to understand the problems of the prisoners here. Our Fay was a reforming Mr. Radford, the fact is that that girl walked straight in with a prohibited drug. Now, doesn't that suggest to you a lack of security at the very gates of the prison? The officers in reception have done 180 hours of overtime in the last month alone. They are good officers, but everyone gets tired. And there's always going to be one brilliant smuggler who'll come up with some new idea. I have a feeling it wouldn't take a new idea to outwit this establishment. We would have found the cannabis by tomorrow at the latest. Would you? I want a full report on my desk first thing in the morning, if you please. Thank you. Mrs. Armitage! What the devil happened? Don't ask. Just don't ask. Well, I'm sorry, Mrs. Armitage, but I want to know what happened in reception. You want I to know? I want to know how a girl managed to slip through the net with a bloody great slab of cannabis. I don't her. know. I intend to find out. And the less people hold me up with childish questions, the sooner I shall be able to find well, out. Well, thank you for childish. Look, I'm having enough trouble with the governor as it is. This has made me look a damn fool. Made you look a damn fool? What do you think it's made me? You know, sometimes I get the feeling you think this whole prison is run for your personal, professional benefit. Mrs. Armitage, the whole future of the drugs unit is in question. Dr. Mays, at the moment, that is the very least of my concerns. 